Keyword lists. These are collections where each element is a two element tuple with an atom as the first element. They're useful in various situations and we're going to see how, how we uh, can work with them. So let's go ahead and open up our terminal and start an Elixir shell with IAX. Now keyword lists are unique in a couple ways. They maintain order of elements. So if you remember our maps, they did not. And what a keyword list looks like is we're just gonna say uh, key underscore list for a variable. And we're going to just, so you just say first. So this is a key and then followed by a value. So that's the first tuple. We don't have to have curly braces around it, but that is essentially what it is. And then second is our second value with the, with the key as second. So when I hit enter here, you'll see that we have a keyword list. And they also allow duplicate values. So, so now we can also add dupe duplicate values. So we can have value and then, so the keys can be the same. Now, one thing to know is this is ordered. So if you were to look up values by the key, it will grab the first one. And so here, let's uh, set this to a variable actually just to demonstrate that. So we'll say dupe equals. So now um, to access values, you can do something, you can do keyword dot get, and then opening parentheses, and then you pass in the list. In our case, we'll do dupe, and then the key that you want, which is dupe, and you'll notice we get value back. And if we do it again, we'll get value again. So you can't access the second one with this key anymore. And then we can also say, we can also get values from our first, uh, oh, I killed the, the instance. I wanna create our, our first um, key list again. So key list equals um, first and then second, and then so to get values from this one, we can do the same thing, but we can pass in key list and then we can pass in second and we can get our two back. And then so updating values uh, is similar to maps with the put, but we do keyword module dot put and then we pass in our um, keyword list, so key list and then we can add our new value with a with a key and then new value and then you'll see our new value there and then we can also convert them to a map with map.new and you just pass in so we'll pass in our key list which is just the two elements and that is now a map. And then we can convert a map back to a list using enum.into. And then just we'll just pass in a, a map real quick with A and B as keys. And then we want to put these into an empty list of square brackets. And now we have our keyword list again. So now keep in mind that finding an element in a keyword list can be slower than in a map. And that's because it's also order of N. So for unique keys and larger data sets, maps are more efficient. Basically the larger it gets, the longer it takes to find the value. And that's, that's our quick overview of keyword lists in Elixir. They're particularly handy for function operations and configurations. So play around with it in the Elixir shell and I will see you in the next video.